Yo, what's up guys, Johnny here back with another Call of Duty Mobile video. Today we look at the bundles in the store. I did show a few here and there, but yesterday on my crate opening video, uh, I did talk about the Ruin Spades crate. And I had a few comments on that video. Some guys said, can you show all the bundles, please? I think less than half the players have bundles and the rest of the players still have crates. So on the top tab, uh, on the left side, you see bundle and I don't have crates and I don't have the daily crates at 40 40 cut points every day so they keep adding more uh, more bundles here and there we had new ones today guys as i'm recording this we have a few new bundles i'm gonna show you guys but also i'm gonna show like the price and what's inside but also is it worth it or not uh, if you have bundles and you don't know what to buy and once again guys this video uh no drama no clickbait no nothing please it's not about is it right or wrong it's just information you already know what i think about that I said it's not fair, it's not okay, but they're there and I don't have the choice. I cannot go back to crates. Even if I could, I wouldn't, of course. Uh, I always said bundles are better, but the, um, like the reason why they have bundles, maybe they're trying to prepare for the future because maybe new rules, regulations, laws, uh, preventing gambling in video games and loot crates and stuff. So maybe they're trying to figure out how they wanna do it in the future. Uh, try to find an alternate way to uh, crates and stuff and bundles seems to be the way to go but the pricing is still yet to to be figured out i guess so we have some green bundles blue bundles purple bundles and orange bundles <laughs> legendary a golden one so guys before we start make sure you guys subscribe to the channel for more call of duty mobile videos if you're not subscribed yet click that subscribe button totally free and we're gonna start with the green ones guys 420 gang gang is the price but we got like uh, a few greens but also a blue with the same price most of these i don't think they're worth the money like even if it's cheap it's like five dollars or something maybe four dollars so let's start with the first one militant malware bundle and the, the green bundles is a bunch of uncommon items and usually these green items uh they might come back in events or stuff or maybe in more crates in the future so i don't think it's worth the money even if it's cheap unless it's a skin that you really 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 like like it might be cool to just drop a four bucks and have all at the same time you're gonna get uh, by the way when you buy a bundle you get everything it's not it's not like a crate you cannot like it's not a gamble you just buy the content so what you see you're gonna get so a parachute and a wingsuit the malware skin and then you got the atv to go with that and then all the battle royale operators so it's a package but once again is it worth the money we have so many skins out there the, the atv is cool but i wouldn't use it so anyways militant malware is the first green one then we got silent stalker bundle and this one has got two green weapons and by the way also why would you buy green weapons because you probably have blue ones or rare ones and the rare ones have perks the green ones they don't have perks it's just collectible or if you really like the skin so this one is the swamp so you get the striker and the asm 10 but i really don't see a reason to buy these and then once again radiant operator skills you only have four this time like they're okay but we have tons of these so that's uh, green crate number two green crate number three the battle hardened bundle once again 420 gang gang is the price and ak117 metal uh metal and then uh chicom so once again a few green weapons for four or five dollars not worth it for me and the last one is a bit more expensive the gorilla warfare bundle 700 cut points which is about seven dollars and then you get some reticulated skins and uh i got that one in a i don't remember where i got it. i think it's in the season crate uh same thing for the knife and then you get uh the msmc the j358 so would you pay really would you pay seven dollars for five green skins but there's a frame so if you really really like frames if you're collector or collector and you want to get all the frames I would definitely pass on all the green bundles guys because it's not it's just not worth it guys so let's go with our first blue bundle here the cyclone bundle 420 again which is about four or five dollars and it, it's just a backpack a wingsuit and a parachute mechanized rain 
So yeah, it looks like just just that rain. So would you pay five dollars for a backpack? I don't think so. All right. Now let's keep moving up. We're gonna have a few a few more blues. Two more. The country morning bundle. This one is a bit more interesting, but eleven hundred cod points. So about eleven dollars, ten eleven dollars. It's got a rare. Well, finally we got rare skins here. Rare skins are are worth using in the game. And you get a very nice PDW57. I love this weapon. I use it in Search and Destroy. But the other two weapons, probably you never use. M21 Sniper is pretty bad. It's beautiful, but it's pretty bad. And then an M4 LMG. And you probably have better skins. Then a flashback. So you end up paying like 10 plus dollars for a PDW. So you must really, really like that one to spend that money on that one. I will pass for sure. All right, next one is the burnout burnout bundle, and that one we talked about earlier today. So this is the ruined spades. It's sixteen hundred, which is probably around twenty bucks, and you get the soldier guaranteed plus all the new steel defense weapons, which is like the AG forty. I don't like, but the the Type twenty five is nice. The pistol is nice. The smoke, and you get a frame hellfire, but the soldier. And I had so many comments on my video yesterday about that one because it's in crates for other players. And everyone says Ferg paid 10,000 COD points to get that skin. 10,000. And I remember buying some skins in crates. Usually when I see a skin I really like, I buy. And often I had to open more than 100 crates. So 120, 110, 130 crates, which is over $100. So you get it for like 20 bucks here. It's a really good deal and if you like that skin, of course you better buy the bundle instead of crates if you have the choice, but we don't have the choice, that's the problem. But if you had to decide, that's why bundles are so great, because you, you don't gamble. But on the flip side, this is the kind of skin that I kind of like, but I don't want to pay too much. So what I did when I had crates, sometimes I would just open a few. Let's say I open like 10 crates and I stop. And if I get lucky, I stop. If I don't get lucky, I stop also. So you cannot do that when you have bundles. You have to go and buy the full bundle. So this is the only negative side. Some guys, sometimes they just buy one crate and they get something cool. But you cannot do that. So that's the burnout one. Uh, and that's all for the blues. We're going to go for the purples now. First one is called Refraction Magic Bundle. And this one has M4 Smart Rifle. Uh, it's shorter. It's pretty cool actually, but I have the M4 CQB. So you guys really, really sure you want that one? The shotgun is cool, but uh, yeah, again, like 15 bucks for an M4. Are you using M4? I think it's not the greatest weapon. So I'll pass on that one also. Like most of these bundles, as you can see, I'm not gonna buy. I have no in intention to buy. So maybe that's also what the test is all about. Trying different bundles and see what's gonna sell. And then maybe in the future they have a better idea how they want to do it. But anyways, the next one is Overcharge. I will also pass on that one. But this was part of the Lucky Draw. If you guys saw the Lucky Draw, the LK24 and the RPD Cyberspace. So these skins are animated. You can see the animation on the weapon. Same thing for the LK. And once again, I don't think it's worth 25 bucks because I don't use LK24. I never use RPD. It's not worth that much money, guys. And then there's a knife, which is also pretty cool if you collect knife. Uh, the rest, like, okay, well, yeah. We have a whatever emote. So the emotes are pretty rare in this game. You don't have that many, so. But 25 bucks, guys, I would pass on that one also. The other two purple bundles on the left are the ones that I bought, okay? So I bought the first one here, No Smoking. First day I saw that one, I bought it. I didn't know there were bundles and crates. So $20, something like that, for the HVK30 Eruption, also animated. Plus the DLQ33, which is my favorite sniper in the game, also animated. And then the smoke grenade and the knife with the animation, the smoke animation. And then we got the trample emo. So that's... One of the best bundles in the game right now. For 20 bucks, you get tons of value. Very, very good bundle. So if you're debating which one you should buy, if you only buy one, that would be a top, top choice here. Next one is even cheaper at 1900, which is less than 
the muted mercenary bundle and that one also i bought the specter geist very cool skin but the rest of the bundle is pretty bad bk57 chicom the pistol is okay but the rest i don't use like frames and stuff it's not really my thing but still 19 1900 god points for a specter uh, skin very very cool all right so we got four more guys uh the three purple ones are just were just added when i record this video uh, let's go with the legendary one. So this was also the content of the lucky draw and I did make a video about that one 2400 card points for the legendary MSMC and the SMRS space station. I, I use that one is actually very very cool. I made a video on that one uh, So yeah, I bought that bundle plus you get the backpack uh, the parachute and the wingsuit It's actually a very good bundle for like 20 25 dollars uh, So yeah, I bought three bundles the the two purples and the legendary and to me they're worth the money for sure so let's check out the three new bundles there's a new no smoking bundle it's called no smoking 2 and it's more eruption skins now we have the kn44 so it's uh another kn44 skin the first one was the color spectrum in the lucky draw when kn44 came out now we have another kn44 skin it's actually a pretty good weapon but the rest sucks it's a AG40 and a frag grenade. So I might go for that bundle. It's pretty cheap for a KN44 and a frag grenade. I'll think about it later, guys. Just wanted to show you. Uh, next one, cold as steel. And this one, guys, I would probably wait because it's the Arctic 50 from the season crates. So you're gonna get these purple crates for the next month as you get more tiers in the season pass. So you got 23 days remaining on that bundle. So I would wait because if I get it for free, I don't think I want to spend 20 bucks just for a pistol, although it's very cool, and a frag grenade, open circuit, uh, HD40 I never used, but that sniper is really nice. I saw it in the game today, it's really, really cool. So 1600, and the last one, Refraction Magic, Refraction Magic, sorry guys, uh, 2, and this one will have something pretty sick uh, ak117 smart so it's a remodel once again like the m4 it's a short weapon ak117 is actually a pretty good weapon um maybe not as meta as it one is as it wasn't season two sorry but it's actually a very good weapon guys ak117 for 1100 cut points the next one is a pdw purple core it's actually pretty cool but if i would buy that bundle it's just for the ak117 just because it's a different model. So it's still pretty good value, guys. The new bundles, not super expensive, and they have some really good content. So yeah, that's it, guys. I wanted to show you the content of the bundles in Cod Mobile. Some questions I see in the comments. Uh, when I show bundles, some people are asking how to get the bundles. Well, you actually can't, and that's the problem. That's why people are so mad right now on social medias. You don't decide like who got bundles who got crates how did it happen who decided who were gonna get bundles and once again i don't work for activision i don't have uh, insider info all i have is what was said on uh, reddit and that's all i have so sorry guys i wish i could help you but i can't so hope it answers your questions also i hope you guys enjoyed that video that's all i have for you today thank you guys so much for watching i will see you guys in the next one don't forget to subscribe take care